Aloha friends, good morning. 5.30 in the morning. Um, um, I always get up at 5.30 because of Danielle. Danielle goes to school the earliest. Oh, where are you? Oh, oh yeah, I like it. No, no, where are my red shoes? The one that we match. What red? The one that we matched. Oh, yes. the Adidas one? Yes, yeah, I like it. Mm. So I help her get ready. And then if you guys see me, just FYI, if you guys see me with like the same like long sleeves, I only wear it. <clears throat> like I only wear it um as like a like as a robe. <laughs> no, not as a robe. Because it's so cold. It's cold. Let me prep up her breakfast and then I'm gonna prep up my hot water. Um, today is a very busy day. Um, I have to go to Lola and I'm going to, um, share a recipe with you guys. So FYI, if you guys are new to the channel, whenever I share a recipe of Lola's recipe, it's like the bomb recipe. It's like, it's, it's just a good recipe. It doesn't matter what it is. It's just a really good recipe. So we are making, um, shrimp lumpia, but not like a regular shrimp lumpia. It's just... It's um, it's like a whole shrimp, and then she puts taro, um, taro slices in it. So really, really good. I've never had it anywhere else but Lola. I don't even know where she got that recipe. So look out for that. Oh yay! <laughs> Danielle's getting cinnamon. Yay! <laughs> Cause I'm like it's gotta disappear. It has to disappear. Hey, Danielle. I watched Danielle go down to the bus until the bus gets her. Bye, Danielle. She has cheer tryouts. I think she said today's the last day. But I'm going to have my hot water. Danny, um, I heard Danny's alarm. Danny also gets up early. It's um, barely six. I don't know how high schoolers can just go to school so early i don't even remember going to waking up at like five o'clock in high school i don't remember that it seems like maybe a long time ago but um oh i had such a good sleep last night i didn't wear my um my apple watch though when i went to bed i was so tired nine o'clock friends 9 30 i was out that never 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 happens but because I've been running and I've been active, I'm going to do some um, house chores, uh, dust, vacuum, uh, put away stuff. Um, that's Danica. She loves to play with the Play-Doh, but I'm going to put that away. Vacuum Java's bed and then do a load of laundry. And then I'm touching up my roots because let's face it, uh, my... My whites are like sparkling up in the video. I color, I touch up my roots every two to three months. Um, and it's just a box color. And Miss Mary's coming about two. So I wanna, I'm gonna clean up, but later, I'll forewarn you, as of tonight, my, um, my kitchen is going to be a mess. I don't know, I think I deleted the video. Um, we're gonna reface the cabinet. I did paint it but we're gonna end up refacing it um, because we're also gonna do backsplash, uh, tile backsplash and then replacing the countertops. So hubby really wanted it to look really, really good. And plus, um, I didn't like how the inside look. I think I deleted it, so I'm just gonna show you really quick. Um, I don't like how the inside looks, so they're gonna give us an option. If I don't like the option, then we're just gonna have to tear down the whole thing and replace it, um, take out that, um, microwave it's just too bulky and big we don't really use a microwave it's just to warm up stuff but i can always warm it up with like um air fryer or one of those little toaster ovens so there's really no need for something so bulky like that and then we had a leak so hubby's um took it out uh he's gonna do the drywall that's what we were talking about on day two i think and then we um we were looking at new cabinets to put in here so that when they reface it it's going to match and that is my dilemma so it's on i think i said it on day three or day four 
uh, about the houses here in um, North Seattle, Seattle area. So we were fortunate to get a big home to accommodate you know the kids it's not big big but it's it's a good decent size we all have our our space so we're not all getting into each other's personal space but with that and then plus being close to the water it is an older home so there's been a lot of stuff that we've been doing and will continue to do so that was my um i deleted that footage because i don't like to do uh videos that are too long so but yeah that's that was uh, when I said that was our situation. This is our situation. So this spring, I really want to work on this area of the house. And I'm telling myself to, to just stay focused. So that's why Miss Mary's going to help me. Mudroom is over there. I'm going to redo the mudroom. I'm going to use the same tile into the mudroom so that it flows. I'm going to take out um, all the stuff into the pantry and then be placing it into here. So it's going to be chaotic mess. But you know what? It is spring now. It's like the fourth day of spring. So I have... I can't, even though it's cold, I just got to get cracking because we do hibernate six months. I mean, mid-September, October is a super, super, super cold. I can't even stand being downstairs. So we're going to work on mudroom, pantry, and then a little bit on the kitchen at a time because we are doing it ourselves. Hubby and Cousin Brian. Cousin Brian's going to be staying with us for a few months. And he's going to be staying at our sauna, which we use as a storage. So it's Hubby and Cousin Brian's... Um, duty job to clear out the sauna read um, redo the floor and then make it into his room because it's a room within a room so he can have his privacy he can put a day bed in there i'll show you guys when they clear it out but all right let's get cracking i missed lola's exit by just one and um because she lives way 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 up north um into like the the arlington arlington marysville area you miss one exit and it's like two miles so now i gotta back it took me forever to go all this way now i gotta backtrack that way but um this is where lola lives and i'm gonna show you guys hopefully that they have the cows out um llamas they have llamas and then also um not llamas what is, what is it is it cows llamas uh, al alpacas, alpacas. Sometimes those um, animals are are out because it's a little bit of a country over here. All right. So remember when I told you guys like um, like new homes are kind of rare, well, um, like newly like not like California because I'm so used to California. There's like so many um, communities like popping up everywhere, right? So this is where Lola lives, and it's a newer uh, community and um that's because they um they cleared out the um this whole land and just built all these um all these homes that look the same because usually with um with washington you'll see like a couple new like homes like that that are the same a couple like maybe the most i would the most i've seen is like maybe you know not like california where like hundreds of them in a community right <coughs> that's not the case that i've noticed here um over here if you have like um open land then a builder will build like three you can see three homes that look like the same the same and then odd homes around it but over here up north because land is more available then they're able to build these homes um that all look the same because they're all from the same builder and this is how Lola was able to get this is that um, she was able to find a community that just um, oh there's no parking I mean there's open parking that was able to build like a lot of homes that look the same I'm not explaining it right <laughs> never mind <laughs> just came back from Lola's oh, we made a video of a shrimp egg rolls shrimp lumpia and then she gave the little girls a treat Whew. and Danica wants to open it for Easter and then Danny got Whew. you like that Danica? <laughs> Danica's, so, Danica's super excited let me alright which candy do you want to try first? she doesn't want the candy she just wants the princess stuff huh? Yeah, okay. Lola got her princess stuff. Whew. I did my kitchen, just little small pieces, and now I'm gonna. I got it. 
You here. did? That's so cute. Let me see. Can I see? Oh, super cute. <laughs> I'm going to go prep up because um, Danielle is bringing some of the cheer, cheer friends that are trying out over so they can practice. And then I'm going to take them to um, oh, cheer tryout later. Take two, take two. All right, call me when you're ready. Danica, call me. Say mom. Okay, take two. I just got uh, downstairs and she showed me. Let me see, let me see. Let's our, <gasps> we love it. <gasps> oh, even high heels. <laughs> Look at her walk with high, come. She's Look. a foot taller now. Oh my gosh, you, you walk way better with those heels than mommy would. You are gorgeous. I love it. What is this? Imagine. What is this? A tiara. <laughs> What's that? It's High heels. So show me how you walk with them. Oh my goodness. Look at that. And she's wearing panty. Love it. Bow. You're so cute. I love it. Good job, baby. You're you welcome. Oh. Nope. Nope. <laughs> nope. The tiara's kind of big. You want me to fix it a little bit? Okay, hold on. Queer didn't know how to put the tiara on. It's okay. But everything is. I love the necklace too. <gasps> Ooh. Love your jewelry. So cute. How was your day, bud? I'm pretty good. Oh. Mm -hmm. Hi, Java. How you doing, buddy? How you doing, Java? <laughs> All right, friends. <gasps> Oh my God. Here is my current situation. All this came, came out of the pantry. All right. So, show you the pantry. So we're gonna clear everything out. This is the flooring that was supposed to go to the sauna, but we didn't have him install it because he measured for the sauna, but we realized that we didn't want laminate. So we're just gonna clear everything out. And then we're also gonna clear out this is the mud room, and because we lost a cabinet, I had to store the stuff here. So this is my current situation. Oh my gosh! <laughs> my OCD is like really kicking in. We got a baby though. Hi, right, trash. If I could just put everything in a dumpster. Like you can't even see the baby there with all the mess. All right, see? This is why they want to start project. But I'm gonna have to go through all the food and then let me show you. So Miss Mary was helping. It's empty. Hubby, I had a surprise for him. Okay, I'm gonna open it a little bit. Oh my gosh. Am I supposed to close my eyes? Uh, a little bit. Okay, walk in, walk in. Closer. I told hubby I had a very good surprise for him because I love him so much. Oh, that's Look, Danica's surprise. surprise. Look, Danica. Okay, open your eyes. Surprise. What is this? <laughs> this is your pantry. Oh, my goodness. <laughs> okay, Danica. Look, Daddy has a surprise for you. Oh, look at that. That's yeah. the, um, she was playing with that overwear. Toys uh, R Us. Toys. Did you buy it at Toys R Us? No, it was at work. Someone had it in their office. And oh, they gosh. Just throw it away. There's oh. hubby. <laughs> All right, so I have I have an hour and a half window to be able to do my activities. Although I've already reached my ten thousand, I'll be stepping out, so I'm gonna go with him because where he's going, um, he has hula, and the gym is right next to the hula. So Miss Mary just left. We cleared out the pantry like really well, and tomorrow she's gonna come back. So I really want to get my running. I don't wanna. I don't want to do any weights or sauna. I just want to do straight running because I had two shrimp lumpia over at Lola's and then I had rice with fish. And my Filipino friends or Asian friends out there, you know that when you eat over at Lola's, uh, if you don't eat, then she gets mad. Okay, gotta go. I was trying to look for a sweatshirt because I'm just wearing um, like a tank top, like a triple layer, like triple layer and then they're all 
short sleeves because it's freezing cold it's 49 degrees and I'm like oh yeah <laughs> my little gray one that I'm always wearing all right so I'm here hubby's gonna drop me off he's gonna go to hula and then I'm just gonna do the is it treadmill the one that you run in place is that treadmill treadmill mm -hmm. I'm just gonna do the treadmill oh, why uh, everybody's gone yeah, everybody's pretty much gone so okay so hubby just picked me up hold on hubby hubby just picked me up from the gym so i want to show you guys my total steps hubby gonna be so proud of me for the day and i'm still gonna walk around the house friends Eighteen thousand. oh wait twenty thousand two hundred two. wow <laughs> it okay. didn't sink in twenty thousand 20,000. Oh, I better put my seatbelt on. Yes. Uh, hold on, pause. I got a story to tell you guys. Uh, pause. Pause. Okay, can you guys see me? Yeah, you can see me. Okay, I don't know if I'm thin frame, but <laughs> people passing by are just gonna think um, we're crazy. Is the light bothering you, babe? No, no it's fine. Whew. Okay, so I'm at the gym. And I made, I took pictures of all the machine that, um, that hubby taught me what, I think it was day two. Day two when he taught me to use the machines. So then I was like, I was trying to trace my step. Like, okay, hubby said to go here and then here. And then where did I need to go? Oh yeah, there. So then I made my zigzag, like hubby said. The only thing I didn't do is that one all the way to the, the lifting weights with all the guys. And then what you do is, um, <coughs> It's basically one that you can do a sit up or a side side crunch. I didn't do that. There was too many too many men around there, but I have a story to tell you guys. So, I made every effort or I made every minute count. I didn't slack off at all. The only time I slacked off is like waiting for hubby cuz he said I'm on my way cuz I know he's like 5 to 10 minutes and then um but then, even then, I went into the Stairmaster. I can't do the Stairmaster. The Stairmaster, oh, that was so hard. I only did two minutes of that. First, it's slow, and then it's deep, and I have short legs. 